Thesis makes it easy to build your own patterns from scratch. Let's begin with the default preset, which you can find in the User folder. You can also reset individual sequencers by clicking the Reset button located on the right of each sequencer section. Click on the Start button to get Thesis going. To get some sound, we're using the internal synthesizer, but we can also route the Thesis MIDI output to another instrument. Let's say we are working in D major. Set the root to D and the scale type to major so that whatever we draw on the pitch sequencer will be in that key. Don't forget to increase the levels on the velocity sequencer to hear some sound. Instead of drawing, we can also directly record by playing the notes on an external MIDI keyboard, either by playing live while Thesis is running, or by using the step mode to record the notes one step at a time. You can also mute any steps you want by clicking on the bottom row of the velocity sequencer. We'll add a little variety to the gate time, which you can think of as note length. You can shorten, lengthen, and shift the loop bar. This defines what steps are played and serves as a selector for copying and pasting. Select the area, click copy, move the loop bar, and hit paste. When the loop setting is global, the loop length is the same for all sequencers. The individual setting here means that each sequencer has its own loop bar and is independent of the others. This can give your sequences tremendous variety, with different lengths, start points, and end points possible for each sequencer. If we are working on a song structure, it might be easier to use different patterns for different song parts and switch between them with the pattern sequencer. To do this, copy all sequencers in our current pattern with global copy paste. We'll paste that into pattern number two and then shift the pitch sequencer up a fourth. Do this again, this time with pattern number three and shifting the notes up a fifth. By using the pattern sequencer to set the order and the number of times each pattern is repeated, we can quickly build a harmonic progression. Don't forget to check out the manual for more information. You can open it by clicking right here. Now it's time to build your own patterns.